Are you new to Windows Phone and looking for some great time wasters? I'm Taylor Martin, this is Pocket Now, and these are the top 5 games for Windows Phone. Windows Phone is often bashed for its application situation, and rightfully so. Comparatively speaking, Windows Phone only has a small fraction of the applications and games that the leading two platforms, iOS and Android, have. About 160,000 apps to Android's 1 million apps and over 900,000 on iOS. But that's not to say that the 160,000 apps Windows Phone does have are bad. In fact, more and more major development teams are joining the ranks and submitting apps and games to the Windows Phone store. And these are the top 5 games for Windows Phone. First, we have to start with Microsoft's own game, of course, Halo. The popular PC and Xbox game finally drove Microsoft to develop a Halo title for its mobile platform, Halo Spartan Assault. This is a top-down third-person shooter, and while it's not exactly like the console game, it's a great mobile extension of that and a great addition to the Xbox Live game titles on Windows Phone. It builds on the much-loved story as a sort of gameception. You're playing a simulation game that lies within the story. The controls are simple, yet sometimes clunky, and it's not nearly as in-depth as its console compatriot. But when you love Halo and you can get a nibble of it in your pocket while on the go, there's very little to complain about unless you're stingy. It does come with a fairly hefty price tag for a mobile game, $6.99. Switching gears a bit, we had to pick a game that was free. Well, freemium, yet still deals with violence and destruction. The game is called Robotech. It's a turn-based RPG game based almost entirely on the luck of the draw. The neon visuals are stunning, and although you don't have a lot of control over the outcome of the game, it's very fun and very, very addictive. Basically, you choose the type of battle action you want, hit the play button, and let the game do the rest for you. It's a great time waster, and it comes with an online multiplayer mode. You should get a few hours of gameplay out of this game before you need to fork over some cash for power-ups for battling more powerful droids. Another seriously addictive and fun game is Jetpack Joyride. Like Robotech, it's not exclusive to Windows Phone, but it's definitely one of the more notable titles on the platform. Again, it's a freemium title, but we won't knock it too much as you can have all the fun you want without ever shelling out a penny. This side-scroller is a classic gameplay style with a twist. Avoid hazardous obstacles by maneuvering up and down with your jetpack or various vehicles. Try to go the furthest distance possible, collect as many coins as you can, and pick up some spin tokens on the way. The game is simple, controls are perfect for a touchscreen game, and it's dangerously addictive with tons of replay value. We can't do a top 5 list without including at least one racing game, and while Windows Phone does offer the Asphalt series, sometimes we like a little challenge. Drift Mania Championship 2 is just that. It's a fun game that's simple to learn and very difficult to master. The idea is to drift as much as possible while keeping your car on the track and as pristine as possible. Do this in the shortest time available with the highest drift score and you'll do just fine. But don't forget the achievements to unlock new tracks. Drift Mania Championship 2 will set you back $1.99. A neat side note for this game, it's the first Windows Phone game to support the Moga Pro controller. But it's not very helpful since we weren't able to get the game to recognize the connected controller. Another title specific to Windows Phone is Elo Milo. It's an adorable puzzle game with absolutely stunning 3D graphics and an endearing soundtrack. Visually, it reminds us of a mixture between the Cordy series and Little Big Planet. The goal is to get the two characters, Elo and Milo, back to one another. Some levels require teamwork where the player will have to switch between the characters to get past certain obstacles. The fewer blocks you travel across, the better. And as with any puzzle game, the 3D levels get more challenging as you press on. At $4.99, Elo Milo isn't terribly expensive, and it's probably worth skipping a cup of coffee for how happy this game's soundtrack and visuals will make you. Finally, because everyone needs some mindless fun, we had to give Endless Robot Street the award for honorable mention. In this side-scroller, you control only one leg of a giant mech. The objective? Cause destruction. Step on people, cars, buses, crush buildings, and, of course, lasers. You can also kick things around if crushing is not your style. Sure, it's a little morbid, and we're not sure why we're so addicted to it. But it's fun, and we don't like to ask questions. Except for ones like these. What are your favorite Windows Phone games? If I had to choose just one, the award would likely go to Jetpack Joyride. But please share your favorites in the comment section below. That's going to wrap this video up. If you enjoyed it, let us know by clicking the thumbs up button below and subscribe to see more videos like this one. Be sure to follow us in all the typical places, Twitter, Google+, and Facebook at Pocket Now. You can find me on Twitter at CasperTech. I'm Taylor Martin, and I will see you next time.